What's up? It's Vince Leo from VinceLeo.com, and I am outside Denny's with my buddy Jay. Whoop. <laughs> now, you may remember a little while ago, we did this whole Denny's vegan option video. And when we were here, we tried a burger. We showed you all the different options you can order on the menu. I'll link that video in the description box below so you can check it out. But now, they have released the Denny's Beyond Burger. <laughs> I'm stoked. I'm ready. So interesting to see how this compares to the old veggie burger they had before and to see what other options they have. So if you like vegan taste tests, vegan shopping, vegan recipes, make sure you subscribe to the channel and hit that notifications bell so you don't miss a thing. But right now, we're gonna go try this Denny's Beyond Burger. You ready? Battle of the Burgers. <laughs> Let's do it. So a little while ago, we did a video here on Vince Leah's channel in regards to vegan options at Denny's. We specifically covered a burger, and we, when we arrived here today, we noticed that burger is no longer on the menu, and it has been replaced with none other than the Beyond Meat Burger. Check it out. So this is very easy to veganize. It says it in tiny print. I know it's in tiny print, but it says it on their menu that the cheese and the sauce is not vegan. No cheese, no sauce, all good. Add some ketchup, extra pickles, extra onions, guacamole, whatever it is you wanna add. Get barbecue sauce, slap it on there. The bun is vegan, and that's it. Voila, you have a vegan burger at Denny's. The hack is very similar like the one we did in Duncan. You just add the ketchup. How easy is that? So like I said, throw any sauce you like on it. I like barbecue. Mm. Slather that on. Move it around a bit. I'm super picky, super picky uh, at every restaurant when I try their Beyond. Well, let's be honest, some people mess it up and totally fine, they're experimenting, they need to figure it out. So let's, let's see if Denny's hits the mark. So they're using a thicker patty. Um, you'll see thinner patties around various other restaurants. I don't know if they cut them in half or they just use less of the meat but this is definitely a thick patty. Then he's got it. They definitely pull this one off. I dig, I dig the flavor of the Beyond here. I always like to tear a piece off of the meat and try to get it without any sauce. So the reason I like doing that is because you actually could taste how they actually season their meat. Everyone season it's different and you know, every Beyond is gonna be cooked different. Um, it's cooked perfectly, the outside is crispy, uh, the inside is still moist. Um, I do feel most of the flavor comes from the ketchup and the barbecue, but they did good on the patty. The patty's done well. Bite. I don't know, I feel like mock meats do very well with the thick patties. There's some, like Impossible pulls it off good with the thin patty. But there's other places that try to do the Beyond Thin and it doesn't work out. Um, I personally like the taste of a thicker Beyond. I wouldn't go out of my way to get it, but I definitely know a lot of people that like to come eat at Denny's. So if I'm at Denny's, this is the first thing I'd order at Denny's, definitely. It's good. It's definitely good. But so it's it's a solid, solid eat at a non-vegan restaurant with a vegan option. And I'm stoked that we're seeing it everywhere. Um, I'm still waiting on you, McDonald's. I know you got it everywhere else. I see it out there, that muck vegan, and 
I want to see that in LA. Stop being scared. Um, Taco Bell, what are you waiting for? Uh, KFC, Big Ups, trying to do this um, Beyond Chicken. Um, but I want to see them as drumsticks. I don't want to see them as nuggets. Um, the bar said hi, you know, and all these restaurants have so much money to step up to the plate and do something um, great, you know, n not just to make money, but do something great that's going to make the meat eater want to order the n vegan option off their menu. Um, and that's what you have to do. You have to vote with your dollar, and the more creative these companies like Beyond gets, the easier it is for people that are not necessarily plant-based to vote with their dollars by buying a burger that's vegan and trying it. It's as simple as that. You gotta try it. All right, so we just wrapped up our Denny's Beyond Burger taste test. And you really seem to like that thick yeah. Beyond Burger here, yeah. man. Thick Beyond, it, you know, it keeps the juices. <laughs> you can still get the outside crispy, and then I can still smell it. <laughs> <laughs> now, make sure you check out Jay's YouTube channel. He's doing this whole series on vegan food in Koreatown and all around LA. I'll link his channel in the description box below so you can check it out and subscribe. And leave me a comment. Let me know what you thought of this video, what you think about Denny's offering the Beyond Burger. And as always, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, comment below, subscribe to the channel, subscribe to his channel, and remember to keep living fit from food. And I'll talk to you soon. Bye.